with everything you've ever made out of paper. Hey, you're right. There's the bird I just made. Is that one mine? Uh, yes. I'm afraid that's the one you gave up on. Remember, Kitty? You said it was too hard. But look on the bright side. Finishing something that's hard to do is a challenge, and that can be rewarding. Oh, I never really thought about it that way, but I guess it is true. Can we try again? Sure you can. I gave up making my airplane because I felt frustrated. But maybe that's just the way a challenge feels? That's right! Mimi, let's make the best paper planes we've ever made. Okay! Great! Now if you need any assistance at all, I'm here to help! Okay, we're ready! First, fold the paper carefully. Like this? That's right! That looks good, Kitty! Think I got it now. When we're all done, let's see which plane flies farther! Okay! I bet mine will be the winner. <laughs> I think that both of them are great paper airplanes. Ta-da! Okay, on your mark, get set. One, two, three, go! Go pink! Go yellow! Oh, no! Oh! Yay! Yellow's still flying! We want to make something different now. All right, then. What would you like to make? A boat. But if we sail our boats, we'll have to put them in the stream. You think they'll float? Gee, I don't know. I'm sure that between the two of you, they'll float just fine. Are you ready to try them out? Yeah, let's do it! <laughs> On your mark, get set, go! Look at them go! So, 
What should we make now, Mimi? Hey, let's make something completely different. Flowers are nice. Want to try them? Sounds like fun. I love flowers. I'm going to make a pink daisy. <laughs> You're doing great, girls. Thanks. How's that? Very good. I could make paper flowers all day long. Me too. Let's make a whole garden full of flowers. Yeah! Guess what I made? A flower that can move itself all around. You made a moving flower? Yep. Let's put it in the garden. Okay, there. I guess I just like things that move. Hey, what's happening? I'm afraid it's a windstorm. It was sunny a minute ago. Build a stronger city that won't get blown down. Do you have any strong paper? Uh, there's some at the paper factory. Great, then let's get going. Wow, this is the biggest piece of paper I've ever seen. Me too! What should we make first? Hey, I know. Let's make a beautiful castle, Mimi. A castle? Kitty, I don't know how to make a castle. Well, I can help. We can make a tall castle for a beautiful prince and princess to live in. If you can help us with the design, we'll do the work. I'm here to help. That is if you promise not to give up this time. Yes, sir, I promise. This time I'm not giving up until the whole thing's finished. Are you sure, Kitty? We've never made a castle before. I know it sounds hard, but that's what makes it a challenge. Okay! Well, let's get started. That's good. Fold it all the way back to the end. Ready? One, two, three. Now cut that piece in half. Good job. That should do it. Oh, great. That's great, guys. Fantastic. Wow, what an amazing castle. It's the most beautiful castle ever. Yay! Oh, yeah! You can't even tell it's made out of paper. And now the prince and princess can, can live happily, happily ever, ever after. after. Farewell, my beautiful paper castle! Stand strong against the wind. Goodbye, bye-bye, and, and thank you, Mr. Mouse. You're welcome. Take care. Bye-bye. See you again See you later. later. <laughs> Ready to go home, Mimi? You bet. lived happily ever after in their beautiful castle in the land of paper. And one day, he would be king, and Princess Kitty would be his queen. <laughs> Princess Mimi and the prince danced and played every day in their beautiful paper castle. And there, they lived happily ever after. Fun and games. Get ready for Kitty's Caterpillar Quiz. Welcome to Hello Kitty's Caterpillar Quiz. Guess who's hiding in the leaf castle today? Mr. Caterpillar, could you please give us some hints? I'd be happy to, Miss Kitty. Let's start with this delicious corner over here. A claw. I wonder if it's a crab. More hints, please, Mr. Caterpillar. All ready. Coming up. The Oh my, that looks like a giant earthworm. Can you eat some more of the picture, please, Mr. Caterpillar? Sure! <laughs> now I can see its eyes. Do you know what it is? I'm not sure yet. Hmm. More clues, please. Okay, you got it! <laughs> hey, look at that! That's a tail! I think I know what it is now. Eat some more, eat some more! I think I'll get my friends to help. <laughs> That's it. I knew it. It's a crawfish. How many 
see if you guess the right answer. <laughs> Not bad. <laughs> and now it's time for animals, animals. Hello, everyone. Are you ready to play? There's an animal hiding in there. <laughs> Can you guess what it is? That looks like a tummy. Let's see more. There's a tail. <laughs> looks like a pretty big animal. <laughs> hey, it's got four long legs. Do you know what it is yet? Wait a minute. It looks like there's something on its back. Oh, now I know what it is. Do you? It's a special animal that can weigh over 1,500 pounds when it grows up. It's a camel! <laughs> Did you know that camels can walk 25 miles a day with almost no water? <laughs> Bye!